What's up YouTube, it's Supercar64 here and it's been just half a year since I last made an update video on my Speed Duel collection of every card um, or item or whatever uh, just a quick thing, I'm just gonna pan up there I do have the first mat uh, I still need to get the other two but not right now uh, so we're gonna go through like all the cards, well, not all the cards, but just a, sm a lot of them. A lot of them, I forgot where I put most of them, but I gotta look for them. But that's another time. Anyways, so, uh, I was, before I deleted the video a long time ago because of Copa and all that, I was the first person in, in the world, that, in my knowledge, to have completed speed duels back when I think when the first slash second set was out. I had every card. Uh, before or as the first set, whatever before term and before tournament packs were a thing too. Uh, I have was the first person to get it, but not anymore. I have a good collection, but I still gotta get a couple of more cards. Oh. Sorry, uh, I just forgot that I have some out of the other stuff. I just put them here. Uh, sorry about that. So, oops, sorry. First, let's go with the loose cards or the big cards. Our great my graded cards. I don't have that much. So first is a PSA um, mint ten uh, ten PSA ten uh, alligator swordsman from um, Joey starter deck from um, Speed Duels. So I got a ten of that. I don't know why I have that. That's a ten. That's a joke, I guess. I have a five point five and then a nine point five um, dark magician. Sorry, Magician of Black Chaos, uh, Speed Duel version. Oh, I, I wish I could have got If I got that as a 10, that'd be awesome. But I'll try again some with my other ones later. I have a Tournament Pack 1 Relinquish. Got nine, a 9 on this one, but pretty still happy. 9's good. All right. I used to have two, but I sold one of them. Uh, next, I didn't grade this one, so I just put them in, in protective um, cases. I have a Tournament Pack 2. Um, perfectly great mouth, which is the meta apparently right now in speed duels. Then we go with the tournament pack one, Gravekeeper's uh, Oracle. Tournament pack one, um, a Harpy Lady Sisters. I'm, I yeah, the rest, unless I tell you, uh, uh, I mentioned it, I pulled myself. Uh, I'm, I'm, if you, enough of tournament pack two. I, I you probably I have a video of me pulling this one, which is amazing. Uh. Uh, I'm some source woman, and then the last one tournament card I have is a barrel dragon. I don't know. Anyway, so tournament pack cards are very hard to come like pull themselves. I'm still missing Skull King, Blue Eyes, Dark Magician, Red Eyes, um, Fortress Well, and Serpent Knight. There might be some other ones I can't remember. Anyway, so here is the complete uh, first. Uh, uh, booster set, whatever, right? So the most expensive card you can get this is Arcana or Joker, and have more copies of him. So he's like fifteen bucks, probably more actually Canadian. I don't know how exactly Canadian, but I'm missing a Blue Eyes Ultimate. That would be great. So it looks like Meteor B, uh, the Sword Dragon Soul, something like that. Uh, this guys were good. Spear uh, Spear Caribos were the best. Like the most expensive card you can get at this, but they did two pr uh, pr two more printings, and you can get them in the starter deck now. So his price went way down now. Uh, I never seen anyone use this one. The great Desert T Twister. No, I never seen someone run that. Uh huh. Then we got the zombies, zombies, and I like the speed duels too because we get stuff we never got, or we only got one printing before, like clown zombie. Uh. I I, re, uh, I remember running a King of the Skull Servants deck, and I completely wiped the floor with uh, with that deck. Now, obviously, you can beat it. So, and we got Twister. Uh, Half shot is pretty good with Amazons. Uh, Michizuri. And then we got the skills. We got Bone Skill. We got yeah, the Bone Skills. This used to be pretty. Penny, Penny, I think this went down. And then Necro Valley. This is pretty much Necro Valley. So, yeah, this is the first um, set, right? 
Next, we go and go with the second one, which is was Attack of the Deep. I still missing the uh, Magician Faith, which Brad has Magician Faith, and I do have. No, I don't. I don't have one. I think they did another printing in the new starter deck. Sorry about that. This just shut off. I think that she went down because they did a common printing now. I don't remember. Then um, Magician's Apprentice, I think it's pretty good. Uh, the best, one of the best warriors you can get right now is um, Blade Knight. And no one really, I never really seen, I only seen this uh, Garfield the Lightning. I only seen him play just a little bit. Uh, this used to be pretty good. Pretty good because rituals were the thing. Uh, I'm still missing a Zombina. I can't believe I'm missing one. Huh. Uh huh. Yummy ship. This used to be good. Uh, I see someone do it pretty, pretty well with that. Delius. Nothing too impressive here. Uh, you always want to run this. I used. I did run a deck based on him once. It was okay. Dust Tornado was pretty good. Uh, first for checkbook was good. At if you're running burn stall, this is the card you want to run. Kind of knock that over. Sorry, it's gonna be a bit of a long video. And it's skill cards. So the best skill card was probably this one. I guess it's technically a fourth. Yeah, uh, Umi. I don't know. I could be wrong. So now we move into this third set. And this one was called Scars of Battle, which is basically more Joey stuff, I think, support and whatever, and more Magician Spellcasters. Uh, Dragon Trooper is pretty good. No, oh, sorry, Troop Dragon. Uh, I ran, I seen people run a deck of this, it's pretty good. And Vampire Lore is pretty good. I actually honestly see Vampire Lore combo with um, Book of Moon was pretty good. Fortress Royal, I still want to get the... This is actually the second printing we ever got. Because the first printer was in a tournament pack way, way back then. And it's priced like 500 probably more. But the tournament pack 1... That, sorry, tournament pack 2, which is the third third printing now. It goes for like a bit over 100 itself. So, nothing... Cabo's was pretty good. And then we got... This is the, the set to introduce machines and Ben to Keith. I'm still missing the Metamorph. Uh, I've only been seeing this play once. This play once. Uh, we got the ultra bright version of uh, Mask of Darkness. We got some Infinity stuff. Best spell card. One of the best spell card before they added um, Waking the Dragon, was it? But yeah, uh, Night Beam was really good and expensive. I only pulled one. And. Here's all the skills. We got the bandit kiff skills and they gave us a another bones, which pretty much this was with to help you with um King and Skull Serpents. Uh and then we got double evolution devil evolutions pill as a bones. And when this first came out, this was like a $30 car, but now it's like technically nothing. Alright. Now this is the fourth set fourth set, which is the latest set so far right now. Is where most of the expensive cards are, are. Like Dark Magician goes for like seven to eleven ten dollars, depending. Not that bad. And this is the set we finally got Ka Kairu Shin. Car always referenced in cards and stuff that we get in the regular Yu-Gi-Oh! And we never got Kairu Shin, and this is the first time we ever got him. So I I'm not, I actually not completed the set. So we got some new, the first uh, insect beater, which was, um, I can't say his name. Hey, remember, hey, look, ancient brand. Remember that guy? Tainted wisdom. You know that what that means. It means we get, Don, uh, we get a uh, skull, uh, yeah, skull knight. Don Zulo, I still miss him. I need to get two more of him. Uh, we got Flint. Bit, and this deck, uh, sorry, not deck, set gave us, Three different Jurak. So we got it. We can, and in the last set, we got a Jurak too. So you can technically now build a Jurak deck, which is one of the ar cool archetypes. And then Golden Beetles are really good cards because you just show them and you keep giving them four, 500 life points. And if you have a 
three in your hand, you keep getting a thousand life points. It's a thousand five hundred. I don't know if that's how it works. Legendary Fisherman's pretty good, I believe. I still need to get one more of that. 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 Drek. Parasite Paranoid. This is like a thirty dollar plus card. Now, so I, I, yeah. So this is one of the most expensive cards in the set. I still get. I need, need to get one more, but I pulled these cards right. And then the one card I'm missing to complete this set is Time Machine. I don't know why I can't get my hands on that, but in time I will. Uh, nothing too special here. The other best card is Floodgate Trap Hole. One of the best. I, I need one more. And this is this set is actually the first set to give us another extra card. So the previous set you you can tell because I can fill out more pages instead. Instead, of, like the previous ones, we only got five skills. That whatever. Uh, hold on. Yeah, every set before was like forty-five uh, total cards plus five skills. This one, this is the first set that gave us an extra, so we got a total of forty-six cards now of regular cards, not minus the skills. And this right here is the most expensive skill uh, skill you can get in the game because it's the top meta and it's cocoon because paranoid. Pretty, uh, you, you get pretty much is you bring out per, uh, ultimate great math right off the bat if played right, and you can and having a three thousand six hundred card. Sorry about that noise. Card right off the bat is pretty much spills game over for your opponent. So yeah, so that's all the sets that are out right now, and unfortunately we ha we haven't gotten anything because thanks to um, somebody. Uh, but they did announce, it's not really a set, it's more of a box, Battle City box. So all the cards there are going to be the exact same, which is kind of a bummer. I wanted a set, but hey, we got to get 127 different cards now. And the only RNG in there is the um, Secret Rares, which we're finally getting Secret Rares in, uh, in this game. And we get getting Egyptian God cards. Anyways, and here's just my extra cards, like doubles and whatever, right? So here's my double skills. So yep, that's all my double skills. This is my double rituals. I have more. I don't, I forgot where I put them. So more canine jokers. Uh, and think and think some out of, of the other ones are in my deck. So here, yeah, more. Yeah. So I gave more of the cards. I put them all the same. Some of the tournament park cards are here too, like Time Wizard, we got tournament pack. The most expensive kind of common, whatever, is the Dark Magician Girl. It's not common, it's super rare, but you know what I mean. And more... It's kind of falling off. So I put, I let, put them in my type. And then we got the traps. Yeah, I don't have that many extra traps. And then we have magic. And from here he goes to sorry, he goes to a second book and ta da. And yeah, some more turn pack cards. And that's it, right? Nothing too special. Until I get more cards. Oh, yeah, which I do have more cards, but uh, I'll talk about it later. And here are like special limited edition cards, cards that are you can only attain in advance. Or tournament packs, or whatever, right? Like special cards or shell and jumps or whatever. So I just kind of organize them as best I can. So again, this just means that I'm missing the ultra rare versions. Like, oops, that's full. the camera's falling down. Gotta fix that. Oops, sorry about that. So, and again, I'm missing Dark Edition for the tournament pack one. Uh, blue eyes and red eyes. I'm missing. Uh, actually, no. I have relinquish. He. I, if the, I put the other ones in the cases because I don't want to put them in the binders just yet, unless I have doubles. So yeah, like this ones I do have. And then there's the ultra rare, rare versions here. I have this is for tournament pack two. And then here are like promos or whatever, right? Limited edition cards. Uh, this is Destiny Draw, which I believe you get this in Yu-Gi-Oh! Day, when the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Speed Duel Tournament, whatever event, and the top eight get this. 
this bandit version you're gonna get in the scars of battle launch event same this uh terror deep you get only in the maybe in trials of the kingdom event launch event and then beat down is the first limited edition let me see no actually sorry not the first limited edition first shoal and jump uh yeah Sh shoal and jump limited edition cards and here skills are other characters that you can only get through an event uh, launch events or whatever same with this cards you can only get this uh Karibo in packs they gave you so this is the second print of Karibo. And yeah, so it keeps going. And this one's here are cards that you only got in the Shell and Jump too. Like they're officially numbered for that's for the Shell and Jump or limited edition. So yeah. That's technically almost all my speed duel stuff. Like I could end the video right here. Sorry if my voice is going back and forth. But Again, I'm going to do an unboxing later on, which I have two extra of um, the first set and the last set. Hopefully, I get a time machine and hopefully I get a blue eyes here. But let me just, just, again, it's a little messy here. I still have all of the um, starter decks up to now. Like we got the Twist of Nightmares. We got, sorry, uh... Match of the Medallion, which are the last, the latest two starter decks. Then we got the Rex and Weevil starter deck. We got the the first two starter decks, starter decks, sorry. And then I got this little uh, thing right here. Forgot, it's like a card case you got for going, I think, for the um, Scars of Battle uh, lunch event. They gave you that. So that's a neat little product, I guess. Uh, and then here, the case sucks, I know, are the all more of the sealed speed duel, star, uh, not star decks, like we call them star decks, um, booster boxes. So this is all of them right now. I have them all. So yeah, that's pretty much my entire speed duel, minus a few things here and there, collection. I just want to put this out there since it's already been six months i just a bit over six months uh well do an opening of this other two but i might do that for a later video uh the, again the most prized card things in my speed duel collection are my relinquish and my dark magician and um, black magician of chaos magician of black chaos i keep saying his name wrong so thank you for watching this is a long video i know um uh phew. Uh, I, I, again, I'm going to do an open later. Please like, comment, subscribe. Uh, I might do another update video in another six months the, or the end of the year to see wh where we at. Uh, until next time, guys. See ya.